Excellencies, uh, dear friends, it is um, a kind of a sad feeling also when uh, a meeting is uh, coming uh, to its end. Um, I think it has been really uh, a great meeting, uh, a meeting of the new champions, really. Like also Premier Li Keqiang uh, said in his um, speech uh, yesterday, this is really uh, the gathering of the future. The future companies that we're going to shape uh, the global agenda. And uh, I think we all um, understand this potential when we just remind ourselves of the fact that uh, if you look at the 10 most valuable companies in the world today, the 10 companies with the highest market cap, many of them did not exist 20 years ago. So just imagine that uh, many of the companies that are here can be on that list of being the most valuable companies in the world in 20 years. There is no reason why this is not going to repeat itself. I think the only thing that will change is that uh, the speed will even be faster in the future than it is uh, today. This is also uh, the time uh, to thank um, you. Um, for your active and very passionate and committed engagement at our 13th annual meeting of the new champions. This is the 13th time we have the summer uh, Davos uh, in China. And it is definitely not the last. I'm coming back to that. For me, this has been an exceptional meeting, not only in terms of the participants, uh, but also when it comes to the richness of the program. There has also been uh, many concrete outcomes. I looked at the list and it was so long that I think we would have uh, had to um, add an extra day if I were going to uh, read the whole list uh, of achievements. But I can give just a very few examples. Uh, the UAE, United Arab Emirates, um, joined uh, the forums, uh, closing the skills gap initiative, uh, launching an accelerator program on reskilling and upskilling. This is really what is needed uh, in a world that is shaped by globalization 4.0. The forum also announced that it will open a branch of the Tropical Forest Alliance in China. This is about uh, stopping uh, deforestation. Business for Nature, a global coalition to elevate a business call for comprehensive action to re reverse nature loss and restore the planet's vital natural systems was launched. I couldn't think of something more important. Bahrain uh, also um, committed to a pilot setting of guidelines for the ethical procurement of artificial intelligence. All the new technologies can contribute in a very positive way for humankind, but we also know that these new technologies need guiding principles and traffic rules. So congratulations on this. This is a good start. And we know those that are procuring has a lot of influence on the products. I would also like to use this opportunity to thank my colleagues at the World uh, Economic Forum, uh, represented uh, here by managing directors on the first row. We have Lee Hobel here. He's heading everything that has to do with the program and all um, what um, has been uh, working in my point of view, not totally objective, of course, but like a Swiss uh, clockwork. Uh, thank you, Lee. Uh, next to him, he has uh, David Aikman. He is heading our office uh, here in China, and his staff has uh, been working 24-7 the last month uh, to make this uh, happen. So thank you so much to all of you that have contributed to making this uh, meeting uh, a success. Thank you. I think they deserve applause, huh? I learned from our Chinese friends that you are also in this country allowed to, you know, clap for yourself. So this is uh, 
uh, inspired also by that. But last uh, but not least, um, I want to thank uh, the municipal government of Dalian for their hard work in making this summer Davos such a great success. I want. I want to thank the wonderful people of Dalian, especially the citizen volunteers that you probably have met for their warm hospitality and friendly smiles that welcomed the world here. So, so I, I now would uh, like um, to ask Vice Mayor Jin uh, to uh, deliver closing remarks uh, from Dalian, and then I'll turn to um, the other Vice Mayor um, after uh, Dalian uh, has made um, their closing remarks, because we are already thinking about next year's uh, Summer Davos. Um, we can keep the suspense, but uh, um, it has to do something with Tianjin. Thank you. Distinguished President Berger and Vice Mayor Jin Xiangjun, and a good afternoon. And so this is a three-day Dalian Summer Davos Annual Conference now comes to an end in the past several months in my preparation work. And I went to dozens of occasions to report to the leaders at all levels, and I need to introduce the work of preparation to the friends and the media. I always say this. We look forward to the successful conclusion of the summer Davos in Xiaoying Dalian. And this moment, I can finally and say that with, with you and all of our efforts, with the joint efforts of all of us, and our wish come, comes to uh, comes true, and uh, again, and we have another very splendid, successful annual meeting, and left deeply in our memory. Therefore, on behalf of Dalian municipal government and also the people of all Dalian, I want to say more few words of thanks at this time. We would like to thank Premier Li Keqiang for his presence in this uh, summer Davos. And I want to thank him for his wonderful speech. And his speech won the heartfelt applause from all the delegates. Once again, made a very strong Chinese voice resound at this annual meeting in Dalian this summer. And also, we want to thank Chairman Schwab for bringing Summer Davos to Dalian. And also, I want to thank him for all the work he has done for us. And I should say, he was, he's supposed to be the uh, uh, oldest, but very busy, the, the busiest person in this uh, annual meeting. And his way of thinking and mind is still as active and innovative as a young man. And also, I want to thank And also, I want to thank World Economic Forum, led by Mr. Aikwe. And uh, because uh, it is a team that we need to learn from uh, Eichmann. And uh, in these days, and uh, they were so busy in uh, Dalian, and they do not have their meals on time. And I had a plan to uh, receive them for a very good meal, but they rejected my invitation because they say what they need mostly is sleep. And in our team in Dalian, and I must say there are some very uh, excellent um, uh, colleagues. One of the colleagues who is responsible for the uh, uh, for the uh, venue construction, and uh, he used to look like me in terms of the tone of the skin color. But now he looks like uh, from Africa, and uh, so my. My colleague said that uh, his uh, skin tone is the most beautiful color of this uh, summer dollars. So I really want to thank him and uh, the team of Dalian. And uh, surely I want to thank all the delegates because you are really the 
hosts of this meeting. I want to thank all the uh, uh, brother cities like Tianjin for their great support. And also, I want to thank all the others. However, I cannot mention your name one after another here. And thank you very much for your contribution to this annual meeting. And in this morning, Chairman Schwab meeting with the Dalian Party Secretary Tan Zhongjun and the Dalian Mayor uh, Mr. Tan, and they look forward to the 2021 annual meeting. In 2021, a year which we look forward to because it is a very exciting year for us because in 2021, China's first 100-year goal will be achieved. And I believe that Dalian Summer Davos in 2021 will certainly be a very excited one. And let's get prepared for it. And finally, I want to say I will see you in 2021 in Dalian. Thank you. Thank you uh, so much, uh, Mr. Vice um, Mayor uh, Jin. I think you also um, heard from the applause that uh, was in warmness and, and a great thankfulness to Dalian uh, from all uh, the participants here. And as you also underlined um, the importance of uh, Premier Li Keqiang's speech, where he confirmed that uh, China will continue uh, to open up and China will continue with economic uh, reforms. Even if there has to be a little bit tightening of the belt, I, I noticed um, for um, all the governments and, and, and regions uh, to create more space um, for the private sector. That was also a very interesting signal uh, for uh, all of us uh, foreigners. Then um, we are um, also very excited uh, that uh, we will um, go back uh, to uh, Tianjin uh, next year uh, for um, summer Davos. Um, we had great hospitality uh, last year from uh, Tianjin, and um, that we have this uh, competition in hospitality between the two cities is something that uh, is also very beneficial for our uh, participants. So, uh, Vice uh, Mayor uh, Jin, uh, from Tianjin. Um, welcome uh, to Dalian and welcome to the podium. Distinguished Mr. Bok, Vice Mayor Jing Wei, ladies and gentlemen, dear friends. Dalian witnessed the grand occasion on Midsummer Night. Here, on behalf of uh, Tianjin Municipal Government, I would like to extend warm congratulations on the success of the 2019 Annual Meeting of New Champions. The highlight of this annual meeting is the presence of Premier Li Keqiang, who delivered an enthusiastic keynote speech at the opening plenary meeting, which showcased China's wisdom to the world, conveying China's strength, injected China's confidence into the global economy, and attracted global attention. And in the uh, innovative and startup fields, and uh, the annual meeting of uh, champions really gathering the elite of all over the world and in this uh, uh, leadership 4.0 and uh, succeeding in the new era of globalization, we have extensive talk and uh, we have the vision at the height and in order to shape the promising future with the commitment in order to promote a force uh, industrial revolution and provide a lot of positive energy to the future. And the annual meeting of the new champions is always having the Tianjin elements. Mayor Zhang Guoqing led the Tianjin delegation to attend annual meeting, and he had a cordial and a fruitful in-depth exchange with Chairman Schwab. He had extensive contacts 
and in-depth discussions with representatives of the political and the business circles. And of course, he also win uh, and gain the wisdom and the friendship. Here, I want to thank uh, President Schwab and the World Economic Forum. I hope that we can continue our good relations and the great friendship with sincere cooperation. To know a man by repute is not as good as meeting him face to face. In this coastal city, we deeply feel the warmth and the friendship of Dalian people, deeply appreciate the beautiful vitality and the unique charm of Dalian, and we learn a good experience and a good practice of a successful holding annual meeting Dalian. So I want to thank Dalian for your reception and the thoughtful arrangements. Tianjin, just like Dalian, is a beautiful coastal city. Its special geographical advantages and historical evolution ha uh, have uh, created a unique urban style that combines Chinese and Western elements. In the new era of Tianjin, occupying two cities, two ports, is the is the maritime gateway of capital Beijing and the Xiong'an New Area. It is an important area for coordinated development of Beijing, Tianjin, and Hebei province. It has uh, many high-level open innovation platforms such as FTA Innovation Demonstration Zone with the uh, cloud uh, computing, big data, artificial intelligence, and the Tianjin Zhigang, which means the Tianjin Smart Port, which is embracing the world. Therefore, 2020, the new champions will be held in Tianjin, and all the preparation work has been in progress. And we will uh, seriously learn from the uh, successful experience of uh, Dalian City. We will have careful plan, careful preparation, continue to strive to present a grand and a splendid meeting. With distinctive features here, I sincerely invite all the distinguished guests to attend the annual meeting of the new champions in Tianjin in 2020, to listen to the Tianjin stories, taste the Tianjin cuisines, share opportunities in Tianjin, and enjoy cooperation development in 2020. Tianjin looks forward to your arrival. Finally, I wish all the distinguished guests a good house, successful career, happy family. Thank you. Uh, so much uh, to uh, our two wise uh, mayors. We um, will now have a short cultural uh, program uh, at the end to just uh, also get uh, into uh, the right mood uh, before uh, we uh, travel. So it will make a very nice uh, landing. Again, thank you very much and see you uh, no later than next year at Summer Doubles in Tianjin.